My name is Robert with Web Developer Ninja, and today I'm going to talk about a pretty interesting use case for web scraping. So we're going to pretend like we have a website, and it's going to be going to tell local um, people that live around the city what's going on in the area. So we're going to make this website that has events, maybe some art, art stuff that's happening in the art, arts industries, what's going on in the bars. And to start this, we uh, need to find good data sets. So to start our little fake website that's going to tell people about what's going on in the area, we're at indianaconcerts.net. And we're going to use dexy.io to scrape this. And then we're going to be able to, through API, through API integration, insert it into our, web, into our website and have it run on a daily basis so it's fresh information. So to start, go ahead and copy the URL. And in dexy.io, create new robot extractor paste the URL and create a new robot all right so this now it's now it's important to kind of study the data so these are going to be the event names the dates the venues and then this view ticket is going to take us off to another website to actually buy the ticket so we're probably going to want to want to get each value and even the link to this ticket so you can buy tickets from our fati uh, fictic fictitious website that we're building and let's go to the bottom and make sure there's no pagination if this is just a straight ta table this is gonna be really easy yep, let's scroll to the bottom and it is it's just a straight table so this is gonna be super easy with dexy.io so you're gonna click anywhere on the table and then you're going to say extract table and dexy.io is going to be smart enough to realize the column names so the like I said this column is going to be event date and then if we scroll over we've got venue and venue so actually right now we're just going to grab the venue and then save the tickets for later so we're going to click OK now let's come to results and so the first one in the mood 1940 swing band here okay and the date you can see that right here we've got a little bit of HTML so dexy.io allows you to click into this extract date we're going to edit and down here at the output filtering let's see output instead of none we're going to say remove HTML so anytime if there's any HTML that gets embedded in there Let's go ahead and take a look at the results. So you see this right here. If you continue to hit play, the HTML gets removed. And then on our app, we can separate this. So let's let this run for a little bit to make sure we're actually extracting data off this website. And it looks like we are. In the description, I'm going to leave a link to a playlist that I created earlier that's going to tell you how to integrate this data through an API into your website. And if you have an app where you want to have a data-driven app using some sort of scraping technology, check out webdevelopernengine.com. We specialize in that kind of work. Thank you.